Supreme Court Associate Justice Presbitero Velasco Jr. says Notary Public Maria Cecil Resvalles Caballo admitted violation of the rules on notarial practice when the lawyer said Senator Lina de Lima's affidavits were already signed before she and the senator met. Section 6 of the Rules on Notarial Practice requires the individual to personally appear before the notary public and sign the document in presence of the notary, but Caballo's affidavit implies that such did not happen. Solicitor General Jose Calida, during the continuation of the oral arguments on the Lima's petitions related to her drug charges, quoted from Caballo's affidavit which says, quote, I was informed that the petition was already signed and ready for notarization. I was then provided the petition by her staff. Kalida is calling on the SE to dismiss the Lima's petitions because of this violation. The Solicitor General had also alleged that Caballo never personally met the Lima on the day that the Senator's affidavit was notarized on February 24 or the day she was arrested and detained at Camp Crame. The Lima's camp said that Kalida's evidence was the logbook of the custodial center of the Philippine National Police where the Lima is detained. But the notarization happened at another place, the headquarters of the Criminal Investigation and Detection Group. Velasco asks the Lima's lead counsel in the oral arguments, former Solicitor General Florine Hilbay, if the notary public put the impression of her seal when Caballo and the Lima met. Hilbay says he is not aware if this happened.